Hi everybody, Neil Bradshaw, Overpie. Uh, I'm going to show you how to use uh, how to use uh, RetroPie. Connect your Wi-Fi through RetroPie. This is applicable to the Overpie System EDK and the Overpie Mini. Real short video. So you're going to start out right here where it says Atari 2600. You got all these video game options. Um, you want to go to where it says RetroPie. That's actually configuration stuff. And so you go into there. And you'll see all these different options. At the very last one will be Wi-Fi. You want to go to that one. And it's going to tell you connect to Wi-Fi network for the first option. Connect, remove Wi-Fi config for the... Disconnect, remove Wi-Fi config for the second one. And import Wi-Fi credentials from slash boot slash Wi-Fi key text, key file dot text. And you want to go to the very first one that says connect to Wi-Fi network. So I'm going to go ahead and go there, and my network's at the very top. Um, you want to select your network, and it's going to ask you to enter the Wi-Fi password. Now this is where you're going to need a keyboard. Type in your password. And it'll say connecting. And it's connected. Now, if you connect to your Wi Fi network, and after this, you're not going to see anything that says success or anything like that. It just connected. And that's all you need to know. Um, it, if you didn't get an error message, you connected. Now, if you go back to connect to Wi Fi network, and you enter in the wrong password, it's going to say connecting. And it's going to take a long time to wait to, to do its thing. I mean, it's going to take a long time. It's really going to try and connect. But eventually, you're going to get an error message that pops up. Unable to connect to network. That's when you know that you didn't do it right. So if you do not get an error message, you're connected. If you do get an error message, you're not connected. There's nothing that says you're successfully connected. It's kind of a, a flaw, in my opinion, of the system. But that's just the way it is. So I'm going to go ahead and exit. Now, if you want to verify... You can go to show IP address. And it will show you your current IP address. And if it's something like, like this one is 10.0.0.215. That's actually my static Ethernet cable's IP address. But this is just for example. If you know what your IP addresses are generally for your, uh, your Wi-Fi, then... Uh, you can look here, and if you've got an IP address that looks legit, you're probably connected. So, that concludes this video, and I uh, hope you have success connecting to RetroPie, connecting to the Wi-Fi through RetroPie. Have a good day.